this under a thick blanket of smoke and get ready to party with Parco, our new world surfing champion. Live from 50 Capital Avenue Surface Paradise, this is Nine Gold Coast News. Well, a ratty and boardies replaced the suit and tie when Bob Catter hit town to speak out against a cruise ship terminal for the Broadwater today. His detractors claim, well, he's already missed the boat. It was a very different look for the Akubra wearing countrymen, but the passion was the same. We are taking them on everywhere. They have had a picnic, the ALP LNP Corporation that runs Australia. Well, the picnic is over. The spit is a long way from Mount Isa, but Catter can't resist a chance to G up the LNP. And I expect that there'll be a terrible price to pay by all of the members of parliament down here and nothing more than cowardly rubber stamps. He's backing a Keith Douglas-led proposal for an offshore terminal. But is it all too late? The state government offered up the land for expressions of interest last month. Oh, hold on a minute, mate. Hold on a minute. I don't follow every single issue in a... Australia. And if you accuse us of taking advantage of a political situation, we'll be taking advantage of plenty of political situations all over Australia, my friend. Dead true. Dead true. The state government says the only proposals that will be considered are for the Broadwater and any other plans, like an offshore terminal, are simply a waste of time. Mayor Tate is convinced Catter's nephew, former LNP member Alex yeah. Douglas, is behind all of this. It's family time, so... Um, Merry Christmas to both of them. Can, I, can we stick to the subject? I'm telling you, I'm down here to make life unpleasant for you. So, Tom, I'm down here and life's going to be increasingly unpleasant for you. Chris O'Keefe, Nine Gold Coast News. Well, Bob certainly is colourful. Coming up, how Microsoft is getting behind the city's IT... ...a large bushfire near Noosa. And why Bob Catter's in board shorts on the Gold Coast. This is 7 News with Patrick Condren and Angie Asimus. Bob Catt has thrown on a pair of boardies and swapped his trademark hat to announce plans to fight the LNP's proposal to build a cruise ship terminal at the Southport Spit. He says his party will introduce new legislation into state parliament to block the move. They have had a picnic, the ALP LNP corporation that runs Australia. Well, the picnic is over. You start making your decisions to look after your rich cronies now, and there's someone out there now that you'll be made answerable to. Mr Catter also blasted Gold Coast Mayor Tom Tate over his support for the proposal. The nurse who took her own life.